Okay, now we all know uh, a lot of a lot of things have changed, and it used to be when people were angry. Okay, they give them anti-depression, or they turn around and just give them prescription drugs, or send them to a psychologist or a psychiatrist. Then they give you the medication, and you know it's just. Uh, People were angry, they were angry. Or some people, like me, are born like this. It's a Scottish gene. Me mother from Glasgow, Scotland, rough part of Glasgow, and came here when she was 16 years old, married my uh, ADHD father, and the rest is history. And voila, this is what you get. Yeah! So, lately I've been very, very, very angry. The wind, I hope the camera don't fall down again. It fell down and I can't focus anymore. That's my fault. Anyway, focus jumps. Damn wind. So, some people told me, Charles, you're too angry. You're too angry. You gotta calm down. You're gonna take a stroke. You're 60 years old, Charles. Just like the, uh, what welfare is reminding me. 60 years old. Gotta take my pension, they remove every cent out. Then I'm angry, they don't, the way it was done, it was terrible, just, just terrible. I'm angry about the cops. Yes, I'm getting flashback with the Fredericton. I'm holding my, holding the hand. I want that camera to fall down again. Um, the cops, same thing, I'm angry. The way that they treated me, no apology for, you know, we got a new chief of police, Roger Brown. Okay, I won't go no details, but waiting to hear from the my uh, from him about my issues, and you know I'm angry. I get flashbacks. So what happens in Fredericton? When you get angry in Fredericton, you cross the line, and once you cross that line, they call the police. The police are sleeping with the justice system, and then they get together, and what happens? You go to jail because you have no access to a lawyer because it's a summary charge. And that's a, just, a, just a loophole to put the people that's angry that has no money to put them in jail. Boys with you. Okay, in Miramichi, I'm just, oh, I don't want this camera to fall down. In Miramichi, it's a different way to handle anger. Of course, we got the Miramichi female jail and the Yuke jail here in Miramichi, but they said, Charles, you gotta learn to calm down. So what do we do in Miramichi? Marijuana. Marijuana was given, as a matter of fact, it was given to me in Fredericton. But they said, when you get to Miramichi, calm down. To calm down. And then I got here, Daydreamer, good place. Downtown Newcastle even gave me something to crush the marijuana with. Okay, so I got, I never seen that before. Crush it, the, the daydreamer. Anything you want about marijuana, any device, ask for selling marijuana, they don't. Okay, but any gadget you want to smoke marijuana with, daydreamer is the place to go, Newcastle. Okay, never mind that, we're not in focus. So the bottom line is, Okay, should I smoke marijuana? A lot of people are telling me to smoke marijuana. It's legal. And they say, Charles, what do they call it? CBD oil. It's good for you. It calms you down. You're no longer angry. You become a space cadet. You become a space cadet, then you say, oh my God, I can't go outside. The sun hurts my eyes. The sun hurts my eyes and I'm just going to stay in front of the computer, stay in front of the Facebook, give my opinion, but not going to go outside. So then I become a space cadet. What's a space cadet? A space cadet is somebody that minds their own business and they don't get involved in issue. If the social assistant wants to come, which they're going after people, the baby boomers that hit 60 years old, they're going after them in big numbers. And these baby boomers got no money to survive the cold winter months. But, you know, what are, you, what are we supposed to do? So this is where this comes in. 
the marijuana. So, what am I gonna do? Am I gonna start smoking marijuana and then when I smoke, I'll be honest, I get par paranoid, I smoke this, I, I see myself like a jumping beanbag, a jumping ADHD beanbag. I hate, I hate myself bad. I will even come to a point of suicidal. But if I smoke this, I will not take a stroke. But then again, me Scottish gene refused me to have a stroke. So what am I supposed to do here? Am I supposed to smoke the marijuana and become a space cadet and just become a yes man or become or keep on going the old Scottish way, stubborn, screaming and become like somebody in a Miramichi angry if we don't get our way. Can you say hospital when they try to shut her down? <laughs> Terrible. But so what are you supposed to do? I'm surprised the cops hasn't been here. I've been screaming like crazy. What are you supposed to do? Smoke the marijuana, take the prescription drugs, or just continue to be angry? Ah!